Welcome guys to a new video, Teacher Jose saying hello to all of you. In today's class, we are going to learn about national treasures. This is Costa Rica map. Around Costa Rica, there are many national parks. Have you ever wondered how many we have? But first, let's find out what is a national park. A national park is an area set aside by the national government for the preservation of the national environment. A national park has purposes of public recreation and enjoyment. How they look like? Well, around Costa Rica, there are many, but some of them are located nearby the beaches, and others are nearby the volcanoes, and others nearby the mountains. There are some things that a national park has, for example, the wildlife, forest, and landmarks. You will find restrooms, picnic areas, and warning signs. There are people who work at the park. We have the park ranger, and a tourist guide. Here we go guys, since you know what is a national park and what kind of things a national park has, we are going to talk about some of them. Are you ready? First, we have Manuel Antonio National Park. In Manuel Antonio there is a lot of wildlife, like monkeys, slots and birds. There are mountains, forests and peaceful streams. Then a tour guide can help you to find the restrooms, picnic areas, warning sites and clean beaches. Here you have some pictures about Manuel Antonio National Park. Second we have Arenal Volcano National Park. Arenal Volcano National Park is in the northern area of Costa Rica. The main town near the park is La Fortuna. There are two volcanoes in the national park, Arenal and Cerro Chato. Arenal used to be Costa Rica's most active volcano, whereas Cerro Chato is completely dormant. There are a ton of fun activities, including the hot springs, La Fortuna Waterfall, zip lining, white water rafting, canyoning, hanging bridges, and horse boat riding. Here you have some extra pictures about Arenal Volcano National Park. Then we have Barba Volcano. It is located approximately 14 miles northeast of the capital San Jose. It is the highest point in Baraulo Carrillo National Park. The mountain features many lagoons created by the streams and rivers. It's an excellent place to explore. There are hiking trails and a wonderful view of the Barba Lagoon, a place to stay in contact with nature and it's really peaceful perfect to breathe fresh air. Would you like to get into the volcano and do a hike?
It is practice time, guys. It's really easy. Are you ready? Reading comprehension. Diane is a tourist guide. She's preparing information about Manuel Antonio National Park in order to share it with the tourist. However, she's not sure if all the information is correct. Please read the test and answer true in the information it's correct or false in the information is not. Let's read it together. Manuel Antonio, it's a beautiful national park it is located on the Pacific coast in Quepos, Punta Arena. There is a lot of national beauties in Manuel Antonio. In Manuel Antonio, there are four beaches. In the sea, there are dolphins and whales. There are crustaceans by the beach. There are a beautiful landscape in Manuel Antonio. On the other hand, there is a lot of biodiversity in Manuel Antonio forest. There are 109 mammal species and 184 species of birds. Besides, there are howler monkeys, squirrel monkeys, and spider monkeys in Manuel Antonio. Manuel Antonio, it's a beautiful national park. Answer true or false. Let's read the sentences. Number one, Manuel Antonio is located in an Atlantic coast of Costa Rica. Number two, there are four beaches in Manuel Antonio. Number three, there are dolphins in the sea of Manuel Antonio. Number four, there are 109 species of birds in Manuel Antonio. Number five, there are spiders, monkeys, and birds. And finally, number six, there are not howler monkeys in Manuel Antonio. Try to get the correct answers. If you want to check it, answers will be in the description box. Thank you so much guys for watch this video, please like and subscribe, see you around, bye!